Einstein believed that scientists make their greatest discoveries by the age of 30. Einstein developed his theory of relativity at 26. He once said, A person who has not made his great contribution to science before the age of 30 will never do so. By that age, Einstein discovered mass energy equivalents. He also laid the foundations of quantum theory. Many scientists made their breakthroughs even earlier. Lawrence Bragg received a Nobel Prize at 25 years old. His groundbreaking research began when he was only 22. He worked with his father on X-ray crystallography. Subramanya Chandra Shaker studies astrophysics. He started his research at 19 years old. He discovered that white dwarfs become black holes. Galileo Galilei made one of his greatest discoveries at 19. He developed the method of hydrostatic balance. Isaac Newton developed calculus when he was 19. At 23 years old, he discovered the concept of gravity. In his mid-twenties, he discovered the color spectrum. He also invented the first reflecting telescope. Blaise Pascal published a mathematical treatise at 16. A few years later, he created a mechanical calculator. Aristotle attended Plato's academy at the age of 18. He contributed to nearly every subject studied at the time. However, the peak age for scientists has shifted. Researchers analyzed 525 Nobel Prizes from 1901 to 2008. They compared the age of peak creativity. Great achievements before age 30 were common before 1901. 20% of winners did their prize-winning work before 30. Two-thirds of them won a prize before the age of 40. There was a rise in young Nobel Prize winners in physics. It coincided with the development of quantum mechanics. In 1923, 31% of physicists had a breakthrough by age 30. Those who did their best work by age 40 peaked in 1934. They comprised 78% of the Nobel Prize winners. The proportion declined throughout the rest of the century by 2000 great work before age 30 rarely happened. In physics, they occurred by age 40. In only 19% of cases, in chemistry, they almost never occurred. Today, the average age of Nobel Prize winners is 48. Little breakthrough work is done by physicists under 30. Quantum mechanics made older theories less relevant. Young scientists cited mostly recent work. They didn't need to learn the older ways of thinking. This suggests that older scientists didn't have an advantage. Their complete knowledge of older work wasn't necessary. It didn't help them make important contributions to the field. Now, however, physicists mostly cite older studies. It now takes them longer to learn all they need to know. Older scientists benefit from their greater knowledge.